In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make over these two dumpster tables that I found for free. Pretty gross, as you can see, but they were easy to make over with new DIY paint one step in paint blue. I'm gonna show you from beginning to end how easy this is so you can do this as well. First thing I wanna do is clean this piece thoroughly. I'm using Humble Suds. It's an all natural concentrated cleaner. I'll put the link to my website. I love this cleaner because it doesn't leave a residue and it's essential your piece is really clean before you start. Because there's glass on this piece, I wanna tape it off. It is possible to paint it and just scrape the paint off the glass later, but that can be a lot of extra work. When you're taping off, I like to use frog tape. Try to see if you can wedge the tape in between your piece and the glass pane, and you will have less paint to scratch off later. Once you have all the tape on, I like to use some kind of a flat edge to really make a tight fit with that tape. Before you start painting with a new can of paint, here's my favorite tip. Use a hammer and a small nail and make several holes in the lip of the paint can. If you're brushing out of the can, you will find the paint will just drip back in and make closing the can with a tight seal so easy. Finally, time to get started. I am using long brush strokes on flat surfaces. All of DIY paint is highly pigmented, so I'm only needing a little bit of paint working from one side to the other. The new Jamie Ray Vintage Cottage Colors One Step DIY Paint is so fun to work with. It spreads really easily and has self-leveling, so these are great products to use when you just want a quick project done with one color. Because I removed the knob, I'm gonna keep this open a little bit while I paint it. So be sure to watch your drips. This paint is really highly pigmented. It is a little on the thinner, but it also covers really well. Like I only have one coat on here and it is covering this really nicely. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just keep painting. It is drying really fast because it's warm where I am today. My piece is about finished. I have done two coats, just putting the second coat on this side here and it is time to go. Side table number two. Not nearly as bad as the other one, but still gross. So we go back and we start over again and we clean and we paint, but this is super fast. I literally got two coats of paint finished on this piece within an hour. It was all completed. Can't be easier than that. Painting two side tables and I literally have like three quarters of a can left. So what's wonderful about this paint is it's highly pigmented, has a top coat built in, it's self-leveling, it's awesome. For when you just wanna knock out a project quickly and you don't wanna have to deal with a top coat, maybe it's just something that you're not gonna be doing a lot of blending or other things on. This is a great go-to paint and the color is so fun and soft. I'm so excited about these projects. Let's pull the tape off. I recommend that you don't leave the tape on too long after your paint has dried. You can even take it off when it is still wet. Try to pull up and away. Uh, it's just that way you don't pull the paint with it. It's easiest if you can just pull straight out. The room these tables are going in has a black iron frame bed, so I wanna add just a little bit of detail to these tables. I am using the Desperado transfer from IOD. These are some beautiful rub-on transfers, super easy to use. I will put the links to these on my website as well. You can easily cut them to fit your space when you remove the paper that comes behind the transfer, lay it down and just lightly adhere it to your piece, and then we will begin burnishing it on. Each IOD transfer comes with a plastic burnishing stick. If you can do a rub-on tattoo, you can easily do a transfer. They're so fun and easy to dress up and change up the look of all of your decor. Both pieces are about finished. I'm adding a decorative knob and they will be ready to go in my guest room. I have two new tables for free. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please check out my other videos on makeovers and subscribe to my channel.